so hello everyone welcome back to my channel thank you for your questions thank you for your comments thank you for those of you who would have been meeting my mom and asking her questions so today what i decided to do is uh who am i get to know a better video so i want to say firstly my channel is zippy zip but my name is Zippora and I changed the channel to Zippy Zip because persons who know me well enough would call me Zippy or they would call me Zip. So it's Zippy Zip. I don't want that you call me by, I would respond. So I came to do this video today to share with you information about myself. So I'm from Trinidad and Tobago, which is in the Caribbean, but I reside in Tobago, which is the smaller of the two islands. Um, I'm a teacher by profession. I've been teaching for over 10 years and I have taught in both the private and the government schools. Currently, I'm at a government school. So any information that I share most times would be related to government schools. If it is that you want me to gather information concerning private schools or specific private schools, you can send me a comment or send me a message and I would look into it for you. I've been teaching, yeah, as I said, for over 10 years. I've taught at all levels. So I've taught at infant, I've taught at junior, and I've taught at senior levels. Currently, I'm in the infant department, loving it. And I come online to share information as I get it, experiences that I would have had. And one thing that I can tell parents is that what we would have learned in school in all time is not what it is that children are experiencing now 90 percent of the curriculum would have changed 90 percent of the curriculum would have shifted for example um things that they would have taken out to cater for the students that would have been doing sca within the COVID time they have now reintroduced it back into the curriculum so as i get information i will be coming online and i would be sharing some would be related to school some may be related to lifestyles it, it would vary based on what it is that i would have encountered and what i can say is the tips that i am sharing is based on my experience and based on my knowledge what may work for me may not work for you but you can take the tips that i would have provided and see how best you can implement it into your lifestyle and your regime so i would have also done tutoring i would have done tutoring with organizations and i would have also done tutoring for myself i would have specifically been zoning into reading phonics comprehension creative writing and i also would do proofreading for persons if it is that you want me to proofread a document for you However, you cannot send me a document that is due in two hours for me to proofread it for you. I may not have the available time. So that's one of the reasons why it is that I would do consultation. So for example, I would have been a teacher, I would talk about that, and I would have graduated from university in 2017, but I would have been teaching before that. And I struggled, struggled to get my upgrade to teacher one that is a tea time story and i can share information with persons on how to get your upgrade so if it is that you would have graduated university five years eight years ten years and you're sat down there waiting because you can't get your confirmation letter from teaching service we shall have a chat we shall have a chat so that i can say i got it done for myself because i got tired of waiting on everyone else that would have said why don't you try this organization why don't you try that organization and see how best they can help you no one but jesus and knowledge got me to get through with my upgrade so that's basically about me in a nutshell i have to juggle a lot of things which is being a wife being a parent working full-time and 
you have to find a balance between work and life because work happens that's what pays the bills and life happens which you have to find a balance in and that would not include your extra responsibilities outside of work and outside of home you may have engagements in church or other youth groups that you're involved in we are here to work together we are here to make it true and I just said let me come and give a video because different persons would have asked questions or different persons may have asked my mom questions because my mother sends my video out to practically everyone and what I can say is by me creating these videos when it says that someone calls me or messages me I can just say okay let me send you this link to my YouTube video so you can get all the detailed information so based on the video that I would have created I would create whether it's a checklist or some follow-up content that I would make available once it is that you ask for it so it may not be posted directly below the video because it may be a PDF document that I would have it would be a PDF document that I would have created so like the registration for school there would be a PDF document for that so there's a checklist that you can check off to ensure that you have completed everything before you go to the school to submit it because it's really hard when you get there then you realize oh my god I didn't take out the passport pictures oh my gosh I didn't get the person to sign the authorization letter so drop me an email drop me a comment drop me a message send back a question somehow and i would try my best to get back onto you and respond if i do not know i may have to research it and i would get back to you so thanks again everyone for tuning in thanks again for remembering to like share and subscribe and see you again in another video bye everyone